Hi guys, welcome back to SSA Athletics. And in today's video, we're going to be looking at the late Kelvin Kipton's running technique and his marathon performances to understand why was he so successful. What he does hold is the most performances under a sub 210 and it's on the list for some of the greatest performances of all time in the marathon. He's also the world record holder. One day that world record will be beaten. At the time of his passing, Kelvin Kipton was looking to break the sub two hour marathon and also preparing for the Olympics in Paris 2024 this summer. It would have been an interesting showdown between him and Elid Kipchoge, two very different runners. Alas, we're not gonna see that. So how different were the two men? So let me explain. Kelvin Kipton and Elid Kipchoge were very similar in many respects, but also were very different especially in the way they ran the race. We've also got to take into account that Eric Kipchoge has been around the block a bit and he's in his 40s now, probably the prime of his life in terms of marathon running. Marathon runners are able to go on for an exceedingly long time compared to normal track athletes. This is because as you get older, your speed decreases. So if you're doing the five and 10,000, you often will go up in distance. Kelvin Kipton was unusual in the fact that he was very young for a marathon runner. He was only 24 years old. Whereas Elie Kipchoge was highly rhythmic, Kelvin Kipton was rough, ready, and very powerful athlete relatively for the marathon. Now this is not to say that they weren't both very good athletes at the marathon, they were. It's just that the way they attacked the race was very different. So here, let me explain. When we look at a sub 210 marathon runner, we normally are looking for consistency of speed over the kilometers. If you look at someone like Elie Kipchoge, he very much keeps to that center line before putting on a massive spurt at the end. When we look at someone like Kelvin Kipton, for instance, he is above that average for much of the race before suddenly putting on an amazingly negative second half, put on an amazing negative split second half for the race, where he absolutely is astonishing in the way that he's able to run so fast, so late in the game. This devastating finish is what helped set Kelvin Kipton apart. You had to keep with him to survive but he would ultimately run away from you. Did you get value from that? If you did guys, smash subscribe, check out all our socials and also the club page, which details about our club. And if you're in the South Venera, you can join. In the meantime, if you like a Kelvin Kipton video, why don't you check out this video here about his Chicago Marathon World Record performances. I'm Adam McCarthy, and I hope to see you in the next one. Bye.